Hello, my name is Sean Dillon, and my topic for this presentation will be mental health for student athletes. So first off, the first thing I would like to mention is 35% of all pro and college athletes report battling some type of mental illness, and those mental illnesses can manifest um, in many ways. Um, eating disorders, stress, burnout, and depression and anxiety are all ways mental illnesses come out in a student athlete's behavior. And of all the college athletes in the NCAA, uh, women athletes are more likely to report struggling mentally while balancing school and sports. And recently the COVID-19 pandemic has increased the amount of students reporting mental health issues because of the lack of competition and all the sports being canceled, the students are, aren't able to perform and do what they love. So why do athletes suffer? So athletes, they have a lot of unfair expectations placed on them by their coaches, teammates, parents. Maybe the whole reason they're out of school is because of an athletic scholarship. So they already have really unfair expectations and a lot of um, stress. And injury also contributes to more stress if they're not even able to perform. Um, overtraining and ongoing pressure to perform at a high level on and off the field. Um, signs an athlete is struggling. Uh, there are many signs. Uh, a couple I listed were mood swings, trouble sleeping, um, lack of appetite, which can lead to one of the effects of mental illness, which is eating disorders, uh, decline in athletic and academic performance, and also social isolation. So effects of mental illness. Um, athletes who are diagnosed with mental illness uh, can experience a number of side effects. Uh, a couple I listed here were loss of love or drive for the sport. So if one of your teammates are, or yourself uh, doesn't find the sport fun or anymore or doesn't look forward to going to practice or train, uh, that could be a sign of mental illness. Um, overall unhappiness, whether it's on or off the field report. Uh, increased stress, like things that shouldn't stress you out, all of a sudden start to stress you out and you worry about it. Uh, poor athletic performance and shameful feelings because shameful feelings is it's in a popular one because athletes are looked upon as these like heroic figures that are always strong mentally strong physically strong so they're kind of they feel shame when they have to come out and say they're not okay and they're experiencing these mental health issues so yeah <clears throat> so what to do if you or a teammate or someone you know is experiencing these things. So steps of action, action. The first step is to admit that you are not okay and to realize that it's okay to ask for help and to talk about your uh, issues. The second step is to talk to someone you trust about your feelings and to address the source of the issue. So whether that be a coach, a parent, a friend, the most important thing is to let people know that you're not okay and to talk about it. Uh, from there, you can go to uh, a professional and maybe look into therapy sessions where talking about it is kind of intens and intensified and a professional is the one having a conversation with you. Uh, some things that could also help with time away from your sport and just taking a break because a lot of mental health issues stem from overtraining and a lot of uh, performance related stresses. So time away from the sport can absolutely help and kind of reset, rejuvenate your mind. And then exercise outside of your normal sport. So I'm a basketball player. If I wanted, if I was experiencing these things, I would maybe go swimming or try something I've never tried before, but still exercising regularly. And then get getting plenty of sleep and also eating a good balanced diet. Because like I said before, a lot of the effects and things that stem from the mental illnesses our lack of sleep, loss of love for the exercising and sport and a poor diet. So there's no time like the present. COVID-19 obviously affected many aspects of our lives and everyone, everyone around us lives. So the COVID-19 pandemic has canceled almost all sporting events until just recently. And the people hardest hit were the student athletes. 
So making your mental health a priority is absolutely a necessity nowadays and student athletes need to be reminded of this. Uh, there must be a balance between school, athletics, and social life, especially with the COVID-19 pandemic limiting each of those areas severely. It is imperative that athletes still reach out for help and get that help sooner rather than later. And this is my works cited. <laughs> 